Welcome back to the channel guys, my name is Steven, I am a Stonewall Gamer. Welcome back to a new season, the second season of Rangers. I didn't get sacked, so we're all good. We have got Euro Cup football. Um, I believe I said Champions League. I thought two teams made it through, first and second, to Champions League, and then like third and Scottish Cup winner made it through to Euro. Obviously that is not the case. So, we're just going to... Uh, quickly draw through there's a lot of teams to get uh, drawn so yeah let's see who will be playing we're gonna skip for them pretty quickly and uh, hopefully we get somebody who A I could pronounce and B oh Rangers at home okay Europa FC or Bronby IF so Gibraltar team or Danish I'm quite happy with that. Hearts gets Minsk or Chirac. Now I do believe, let's draw all teams, there is another draw. Yes there is. So, this, no that was it. It was the first and the second qualifying rounds that was drew, drew today. So uh, I'm going to play the friendlies, see if any transfers happen. I will quickly just show you. Um, 300,000 transfer budget, 279 thousand wage budget only thing that's changed so far what am i going on not that one i want that one um is clint hill he's gone i shouldn't be doing it on that should i really it's as you can see i am uh currently looking to get players but uh doo -doo -doo, where is he there he is that's clint hill retired and we let a load of youngsters go ryan hardy's gone out on loan Nobody in yet, so nothing to report. But I'll bring you back uh, when I've played games and done stuff. See you in a minute. Welcome back, guys. And I just thought I'd bring you back for this. Um, Euro Cup, they want us to reach the group stage. The Premier League, they're happy with the Euro, Euro Cup qualifying in the league now. So not as much pressure in the Premier League anymore. And uh, Scottish Cup reached the final which depends when we re we get Celtic. Um, I'm not going to go through any transfer stuff until the first game, so I'll see you in a minute. Welcome back, guys. I've got a lot to go through. Only one game today. Um, quickly tell you, we got Drew against uh, Bronby, so we will be playing them today. Next episode will be Bronby and either the third qualifying leg or will be the Betfred Cup, but... I might just skip the Bedford Cup. Anyway, right, let's quickly go through this as uh, as quickly as we can. Right, I've already told you about Clint Hill, retired. Kelly Miller, retired. Um, we've sold Harry F Forrester, so no more Harry Forster. I nearly did that as well. Um, 600,000. Load of youth went. Now, inbound, we've got a fair few and we've still got bids on people. This is a money-making scheme, mainly. There's two players that will play for us the rest are either going to go out on loan build up sell for more money or hopefully could become a really good players they are capable of it but we're not going to be able to keep hold of them anyway first one william he's a um brazilian 18 year old attacking midfielder center and look at his stats he's bloody good um I don't he's not on loan yet I don't think anybody wants him um, at the moment uh, we've got Victor Lenin again good stats um, all round decent Brazilian no I'm not gonna be bringing in a hell of a lot of Brazilians this is purely because we need money and this is a great way to uh, build a couple of players up and sell them off so it's a quick scheme basically Matthew Pennington, we got him on loan from Everton. He will be playing for us. Um, basically, with Senderos getting injured all the time, we needed somebody in that defensive centre who is going to do well and isn't going to get kicked all the time. So he will be our man for that. Uh, I've already told you about Niamsi a few episodes ago. He's now joined us. Um, thinking of sending him out on loan as well. Why not? Uh, we've got Kyle Noyle. I'm going to go with Noyle. Uh, it's probably wrong, but, you know, he is English. Um, 
we got him on a free, as you can see, 30k, 14k. We got him on a free from West Ham. Uh, got a bit of building up to do, but they all have at least four star, some most of five star potential. So they've all got that room to build. Um, Dos Santos, uh, again, great stats. Uh, not amazing, but the stats that we want are really good. Tackling 12, heading 14. He's quick. Um, he's even can put it in the net if he wants to. Determination 15. Yeah, good all-round player, or will be at least. Paulo Ruggiero. Ruggiero. Ruggiero? Ruggiero. I'm going to go with Ruggiero. Sorry about this. Um, again, all-round, half-decent player. He's a um, left-back, so he's still got a long way to go. But with the potential he's got, we could really make something of him. Uh, we've got... Uh, Manuel, again, great stats, another Brazilian, um, as you can see there, he is on loan, he's on loan, he's on loan, so we've got some of them out already, so that's one thing, we've also got Yuri, who's um, already quite a good bloody goalkeeper to be honest with you, but he is also out on loan, you, you'll see some of them couldn't get work, work permits, but as I said, they are purely to make money. Um, we have Eduardo. Look at the stats. Uh, he's a poacher. 15 finishing and he's 18 years old. Another Brazilian. Um, the one thing I don't like is that he's unambitious. However, we got him for 10,000. So all these we will make a profit on them. There's no doubt about that. Um, Evandro. Again, half decent stats. Still got a bit of a way to go. But... A year, two years, all these players will be going and we should have a chunk of money which we can then put back into a the, the team. La uh, second from last is Tuta. Teamwork and work rate I'm loving. Um, it's a defensive centre but like his heading's only nine. He, he's got a bit more building up to do but um, we can't get him on, away on loan at the moment so he's sat in the under 20s until... Somebody wants him. Um, and then we got on a free transfer who was released from Arsenal, um, Zelalem. Good, very good player. Um, midfielder. Just going to take Harry Forrester's place. Not that Forrester was playing, but for a free transfer, very good. So that is all the action that I've been up to. Uh, there is more to come. There's a lot more to come, but... Um, yeah, as I said, we are just building up these go build up these players and sell them on for a wedge of money. Or if we get work permits for them, and a couple of them will go into the team. But for now, it's a money making scheme because that's what we're lacking, unfortunately. Um, other than that, let's start playing, shall we? There's not much else to say. Oh, here's another one. Look, Liam Shepherd. I'll quickly show you him. Um, he's a right winger. He's, he'll, I'll get uh, Garrix to train him. Great. Tw he's 22, Welsh. Let's have a quick look at the full report. Again, look, three, four stars. So he's got a bit of learning to do, but he could either become one of the main players or sell him off for more money. So uh, let's get on to this Blondby game and play the first leg of the second qualifying round. Hopefully... Hopefully, we get through without any ease. Okay, guys, welcome back. Um, this is the team. We're going to go straight into it. Robbie McCrory in goal. Garrix and Wallace on the wings. Wilson and Pennington in the centre. Kirch just in front. Holiday as the ball-winning midfielder. Holt as the advanced playmaker. Mackay, Waghorn, welcome back, lad. And Garner. Um, Waghorn wanted a new contract he did uh derby went in for him and he said uh he wanted to go but i kept him and i made no it wasn't him it was lee wallace look sorry lee wallace wanted to go but he said he'd stay if i ensure we win some silverware i thought well the bet fred cups silverware so yeah let's even if i just keep him here for one more year I had to hold on to him. I can't let him go. Not yet. And I don't want to. I really don't. Let's get into this game. There's a few people who are knackered. Don't care about numbers. 
but I need my full team out for this. Let's see if I can pronounce any of these names or right, okay. Uh in goal they have Ranau, Hansen and Casado on the wings. Rocker is probably something funny because the double dots over the O but I don't yeah. Um Balkalem Ilso Klenberg Norgard Colson Puki it's probably not Puki. Puki? Puki we'll go with that sounds a lot better than Puki. And uh Gerber. If uh, I've definitely got those wrong wrong because I struggle with English names for God's sake as you've all uh, made it blatantly obvious. But they're lining up exactly the same as us almost. We just seem to be a bit more attacking, so this is interesting. We're going to uh expect to win, nothing more. Because we are at home and it is Bronby. Let's get this game underway. Right, they kick off going from right to left. I also had the option to um, shorten the pitch. So that's exactly what I've done. Just so we can, um, we don't get done so much on the wings and we've got advantage in that middle. So the first 10 minutes and they have possession but we keep having... Shots by the look of it. Here we go. First highlight. Garrix has the ball. He's whipped it in. Holt's got it. And he's been taken down by Hansen in the box. And that is a penalty. The uh, commentator thinks it was harsh. Waghorn steps up. And he's put it in. Welcome back, Waghorn. Scores a goal. And the first goal of the European competition for us. Fantastic. Hopefully, nice and easy. We get past these. We get into the group stage, which is what is expected of us. And, um, yeah, happy with that. Um, McCrory, I'm expecting him to really develop over the next year. especially Because uh, he will be our first team goalkeeper. And if he doesn't go to plan, then we've got Yuri, if we can get a work permit for him. But that's a long way in the future yet. Anyway, we are at half-time, 1-0. And uh, business as usual. I'm going to tell them I'm... No, we can do better. Okay, they're not really that interested, to be fair. But, yeah, um, it's been a good two hours. I've been, work been going through so many contracts, co you know, um, trying to get the best deals. Oh, Mackay, we've got a chance. He runs at him, strike the goalkeeper. Yeah, trying to get the best deals, finding players. It's been been a long night, I'm not going to lie to you. But I do it because I love it. That's why we all do it, don't we? Joe Garner's on 77%. We've got a couple of people who are knackered. Uh, Garner's not having a great game, so Zach Wooden can come, hit, come in for him. Um, I don't really want to change anybody else. I'm thinking of Wallace. Because he's a bit knackered. But no we'll just change that. Just Zach Wooden can come on. And uh, I re really want a, another goal here. Oh god here we go. Garrett's clears. Bra Bragger's got Brogger's got it. I'm going to get these names terribly wrong. Waghorn. And he's tackled by Hansen again. Right that's twice now. Why isn't he already booked? Thank you. Foul. It might be another Hansen. I don't know. Pennington takes it. He's giving it to Wallace. Can he... Make something happen. Wooden. Yes. 2-0. That's exactly what I wanted. And uh, Wallace once again down that wing. Crosses it in. And Wooden's on the end of it to slot it home. Fantastic. 2-0. That's what I like to see. We are 60, 70 minutes in. And uh, right. Have we got. Let's bring on. Zelalam. And tell me if I'm telling his name wrong. Saying his name wrong. Zella, Zel Al M. Zelalam. Oh. I might just call him Jed. Um, yeah, I'm going to give him a bit of game time. And. Let's give. The other McCrory a bit of game time. Just to. Just for the experience. I do like the fact that I've got a bigger squad and they're all young because now I can afford to rotate, especially in the league or the cups. So 
It's oh Waghorn's taken a knock. Damaged heel. Oh god. So it's the last seconds anyway. And uh that will be the final whistle. 2-0 to Rangers. Very happy with that. All right, I'm gonna um take a quick look at the time of this video and see how long it actually is and you might see a second game if it hasn't taken too long but I'll see you in a second either way welcome back guys we have the Euro Cup third qualifying round draw we haven't played the second leg yet but let's do this shall we just go one at a time until we get drew and let's see who we who we will be playing if we go through clicking away someone nice at Aberdeen will be playing Glen Torren or Astana, fair enough. No one tough, please. We haven't been seeded for this, so it's going to be um, a pain either way. However, the seeded team, I well, see this group, to, I don't want Tottenham. I do not want Tottenham. Come on, draw us already. Right, okay, we're coming close. To the end I think maybe we're gonna be the last ones out aren't we Tottenham oh whole oh, hearts might have Tottenham we will be at home and we will be playing PSV okay guys that is the end of this episode we uh, beat Bromby and we've been drew to PSV Bromby and uh, PSV in the next episode and then the one after that will be the PSV decider and We'll see. Betfred Cup, maybe. We'll see what happens. But, um, as always, guys, hope you enjoy. Take care.